What's up, fam? So we're gonna kind of have like a little like uh, kind of like a just a classic weekend vlog uh, this weekend. Um, but it kind of started out with uh, <laughs> uh, some bad news. Tucker woke up with a really angry eye. Um, we think this is the same thing he's had when he was like it's like one and a half. One and a half. Yeah. But it's it's pretty bad. He can't even open his eyes. So we'll show you that. But we are gonna be headed to the doctor uh, this morning. Uh, we just called his um, pediatrician. He said get him in right now. That's where we're headed, so. He's happy, and he's not yeah. in pain. He's like smiling, but he can't even open but his eyes. He, he he yeah, his he's eye. happy, but his, his uh, eye is very and angry. And he said he opened his eye a little. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll go ahead and show you, and then we're gonna head to the doctor and start out the weekend. So it's a good way to start it out. Okay, so this is some uh, cream that we have on him that the pediatrician told us to put on, but that's what it's looking like, poor guy. How's it feeling, dude? Is feeling good? Yeah, he's watching. He's watching Doc McSuffin right now. You you want to go to the doctor? No, he does not want to go to the doctor. So that's gonna be a fun thing. But his eyes opened up a little more. It was it was sealed shut when he woke up. But a bunch of. It's opening a little bit, huh? So um yeah, so we're gonna head to the doctor and see what's going on. Well, Tucker's loaded up. He's got his banana muffin. Got his Buzz Light here. I think we're good to go. So we probably should have mentioned that today is Thursday. It's it, it's today's like our Friday basically. On Saturday I have several meetings, and so I ended up taking Friday off, and Lacey has Friday off. The boys usually go with Lacey uh, to school. She's a teacher, but obviously today Tucker's not going to school, so um, I'm taking Tucker to the doctors. Lacey's taking Landon to school, but he's pretty nervous about seeing the doctor. Excited to see the doctor? No. No, not at all. We're at the doctor's office. I think you, it's yellow. It's a yellow? Yeah. We got your temperature checked. Uh, 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 look, look it. <laughs> Is that your tongue? So the doctor gave Tucker three dinosaurs because he opened his eyes so big. And a sucker. My goodness. Good job for opening your eyeball. Now we're just waiting to see what's going on. Say, hey, you guys. <laughs> In that movie. <laughs> hey, Tucker. Maybe after this, we can get some donuts. Don donuts. Oh, donuts. What kind of donut do you want? Um... A gray one. A gray one? Yes. Okay, so update. Uh, we still don't know what's going on. Um, we have to now head to an eye specialist. She was able to get us in today, so I have to. I have a window I have to get in there that they can squeeze us in. So I'm headed, headed downtown Boise right now um, to go to um, the eye specialist. And hopefully we can see what's going on. The problem is it's it's sw so swollen that they want to make sure that everything's okay inside. And he's just munching away on his sucker. He doesn't know that he has to go to the doctor again, which is, it's not going to be fun for that. But um, hopefully we can get some answers. Okay, okay we go to the third floor. Third floor, here we come. So we're all checked in. We got to sit outside of 3D. You say 3D? 3D, yep. Maybe in the top. <laughs> Your poor eye, dude. <laughs> Gosh. Cool one? That is a cool one, huh? So we're just waiting for the doctor to come out. I originally did not think that this is going to be this much part of the vlog, but this is how it goes. <laughs> hey, Tucker, have you named your dinosaurs yet? Uh, What's your names? Tucker. That one's Tucker? No, it's... That's... It's my Tucker. That's Tucker. Then that's Jaden. Yeah. And that's Mommy. Where's Daddy at? Uh, <laughs> I think you at school. I'm at school? Yeah. <laughs> uh, you at church. Okay, uh, I'm at church? Yes. <laughs> Okay, so this was a, a hard part. We have to dilate his eyes to make sure that there's nothing in the back of his retina. 
Um, and that was pretty painful for him. You doing okay, Tuck? Yeah. <laughs> Little, little, his eyes are bleeding a little bit because it kind of got torn trying to get the, the eye drop in there. But we're doing good, huh? Yeah. Well, everybody, we're back in. Um, broke the skin a little bit having to look inside there. So I asked Tuck what he wanted for lunch because, you know, we're going to treat him for all of that. And he said he wants cheese pizza and he wants chocolate milk from Dutch Bros. So we got a chocolate milk from Dutch Bros. And we got a Domino's cheese pizza yeah, we, just for him. And Tucker or Landon's in the car. We picked him up yeah. so he can celebrate with the cheese pizza. And Landon ended up getting a hot chocolate. So, yes, you may. Yes, you may. How's that chocolate milk, dude? It's yummy. It's yummy. How's that your hot, hot chocolate? It's yummy, but it's really hot. <laughs> it's really hot. All right. Well, everyone's happy. Let's get some pizza. And daddy has to go to a meeting, so fun times. Well, we're home. Chocolate milk, pizza. How you feeling, bud? Good. Good. Oh, gosh. It's pretty aggravated from having to pry it open. Boom. There she is. There she is. <laughs> How's the pizza, Landon? Good. Good. Everybody, we are making some Mickey Mouse waffles this morning. What are you making, Tuck? Um, some, some Mickey Mouse pancakes. Some Mickey Mouse pancakes. Yeah, how's your eye feeling? Good. It's feeling good. Let's see it. Let's see your eye. Yep, it's definitely still pretty angry. <laughs> good job, Tuck. Good mixer. I only need one egg. You want me to do it? Yes. Okay. Last daddy. Okay, we're watching. Good job. Can you show everybody your eye? There it is, guys. Watch. <laughs> yeah, we're watching it. What is it called again? <laughs> Flora and Ulysses. Yeah, it's like a squirrel movie on Disney Plus. <laughs> Boys love it. Okay, yeah, uh, it's definitely still really angry this morning, but it's, we're hoping, hoping it would be a little bit more tame. Yeah, apparently not. Apparently not. You're doing like me. At least he's in a good spirit. Yeah, he is. Good old Tuck. <laughs> Mm, mm, mm. Okay, so this is what I make Lacey every morning. Mm, not every morning. Well, I mean, I would say <laughs> five days a week. So, okay, not every morning. But this is the most common drink I make you. Three, what? Four. What's yeah. in it? It's Americano with... What's Americano, Lacey? <laughs> espresso and water. And then it's got half and half and then um, vanilla and whipped cream on top. Yes. So good. So it's two shots, mm -hmm. pull two shots, mix it with half and half. Okay. Good. And then we put about a sh uh, maybe like a pump and a half of Starbucks vanilla mm -hmm. syrup. Yeah. And whipped cream. Sometimes we put some cinnamon on top. Yeah. But, yeah. We don't want to go too crazy this morning. Mm -hmm. I'm not that special today. Yeah. <laughs> and there's Mr. Tuck just eating his pancakes and watching his show. <laughs> That's a good pancake, Landon. Good job. Yeah, I guess it is a waffle. Well, it's kind of, I mean, it's pink. It's, it's a pancake mold, kind of, right? Well, it's, it, it's a waffle ingredients. Can, and I it's, have, can I have chocolate? It's a waffle. Too? It just looks more like, because you think of like a waffle yeah, has like buddy. holes in it everywhere. Can I have a chocolate milk too? Chocolate milk and 
pancakes? Question mark. <laughs> so it's time to give Tucker his medicine. We have to do this two times a day, and um, I'm hiding my he hides behind the couch. It's it's gonna be a long, a long week. It's okay, buddy. It's okay. It's okay. All right. Oh. I'm gonna put the put the camera down and try to help with this. All right. We got it in. You did it. You did it. A little bit of his hair too, but. Good job. Where's my ball? Right here. There's your ball. High five. No. Okay. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Okay. Well, today's been kind of one of those days where it's just been kind of rainy outside and kind of inspired us to clean the house, mm -hmm. organize, and we didn't really like film a lot of that kind of stuff because, yeah. you know, we didn't. We played a fun game of hide and go seek. We played hide and go seek. Well, it was called ninja hide and go seek. Yes. Um, so the diff, what was the difference that Landon said between that? Um, when you find them, you have to chase them with like a ninja sword. Oh, okay. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's what we did for a while. That was fun. Um, and then we played a fun game of Q&A on Instagram. Yeah. With you guys. That was a lot of fun. It was. We should do that more often. We have never done that before on our channel. We've done, like, we've asked questions, but not like a, a Q&A. Right. And it sounds like people want to know our dating story and like how we met yeah. and stuff. Yeah. We did a poll there, so we're going to kind of talk about I think that I think like. it's at 100% right now. Oh, cool. Actually, let me, yeah, let's check that out. But in the meantime, Lacey, what are you doing? Oh, yes. Yeah. So we got a file cabinet. Boom. Um, for our office. <laughs> we're finally being adults and filing important papers. Yeah. Because <laughs> we have this, like, little binder. It's kind of pathetic. And it's... Like, it's one that kind of, like, opens up, like, an accordion and comes in. But we've got, like, all of our, you know, stuff from taxes or just important documents in there. And it's just not organized. And then all of this has been, like, in our, we have, like, a little mail file thing mm -hmm. behind our uh, garage door in our kitchen. And it's just been overflowing. And we just need to organize it. A lot of this is probably going to be in the garbage and some things we need to keep. But yeah. just, um much needed this little file cabinet pretty stoked about I like it has a little door right here too yeah what i loved about it is that we oh. didn't have to put it together it just came like this out of the box ready to go so and i'm putting some of these little guys there. i can't believe we haven't had a file cabinet before yeah so I mean, okay so I'm... look at this guys um over 90 of you so far have said yes 100 percent. there's been no no's so that means we probably should do a how we met video yeah so we had our like home studio kind of like tour thingamajig video <laughs> uh, a couple weeks ago and it was just me on that video so we never really got to see Lacey's like you know review of it I guess um, so Lacey do you like it? I really like it and I feel horrible because he showed it to me when I came home from work and I was like this looks so good I didn't help with anything <laughs> I really didn't uh-oh, somebody's coming. Someone's coming in. Who is it? But I think it looks so good, and it feels so relaxing up here. Hello? Come in. <laughs> they're too limey. They're, they're too limey. They're too limey. <laughs> so, hi. Hi. How's your lime? What is this? Did you squeeze lime juice for me? Fresh <laughs> lime juice? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm not drinking that. It's going to be so sour. Try it, Lennon. I want you to try it. <laughs> It's pure lime, folks. You like sour stuff. Good. With no expression. It's making my tongue tingle. <laughs> Doesn't he make used your... to like suck on lemons he as did. a baby too. Doesn't that make your tongue tingle though? A little bit. No? It's good. So yeah, it's been nice. I, really uh, like it. I mean, what we've had it for a couple weeks now, and honestly, we've we've changed some things. Like we have my drum set now in here, which is kind of a cool, I think, look of it. And Lacey added this frame up here. Oh yeah, my um, one thing I did. <laughs> that is the one thing you did. Uh, so we're kind of still working on like this wall area here. We're actually thinking about maybe hanging Lacey's um, ears on this wall rather than having it like in a magazine holder. But we're still kind of thinking through all of that. But other than that, it's been pretty cool. The reason why we have all these drinks over here is because 
We are planning on getting a little mini fridge maybe today that will go on top of this file cabinet. I do not need a mini fridge. I'll just we tell don't you right now. at all. <laughs> but I sold a couple things in the studio that we didn't need anymore, and I'm like, like as you can see right there, there's literally money sitting here. So you just have to spend it. So yeah, you have to spend it. I'm like, what should we spend it on? Well, we want some cold drinks, like sparkling water, water. Like seriously. How many times is it when we're editing up here, like, oh, I need water. We have to go all the way. Because it sounds so lazy. Yeah. First world problems. Go all the yeah. way downstairs and get a water bottle. Mm-hmm. Have, the, have them in the mini fridge. Yeah. Done. Have some mm -hmm. cold brew in there, maybe. I mean, <laughs> it's endless. And we actually already told Landon that one of his chores now is going to be Stocking. restocking the mini fridge when we get it. Yeah. So it's brilliant. It's yeah. Brilliant. Giving our kids more jobs <laughs> and keeping us hydrated. <laughs> Yeah. But the rest of the day, we are um, not like a lot of plans. Landon's got Taekwondo. Mm -hmm. For those of you who haven't seen anything um, be before this, we ha we'll link below his Taekwondo video. But he's doing that, and he's a yellow belt now. So he's sticking yeah, with he's it and loving it. Professional. And we just yeah. finished our budget. Yes, worked on that. Just adult stuff. Mm -hmm. That's but fun. I, think, crazy. I think we're going to kind of maybe just kind of recap what happened to Tucker yeah. and then probably close out the vlog since we mm -hmm. just have a lot of running around to do today. Yeah. So that's what we're going to do. Mm -hmm. All right, Lana wants me to try this slime <laughs> thing. I already did. It was... it's oh! so <laughs> I don't know how you do it without like having a straight face, dude. Let me try it, Okay, guys. do it for the camera. Let help. me try it, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Not even sour to you? <laughs> okay. <laughs> we you entering into some like sour lime contest soon? <laughs> what are you doing? First off, we just want to say thank you guys so much for just the care, the kind words. It was just like genuine, like just the outreach you guys mm -hmm. like the love you poured yeah. down on us. <laughs> and just prayers for him. Yeah. And it was just, just the compassion mm -hmm. shown there. It was really, Meant a it lot. was overwhelming. Like, it was. It was like, whoa. It kind of helped us, I think, uh, kind of process what was going on because um, it was it was just, it was so weird. Like, you know, like I think our, like it was crazy. Like if, the, if you follow us on Instagram or Facebook, um, the first, we, we posted a picture of us like making pour over. Like it was just kind of our routine. <laughs> start of the day. So started, kind of our, our routine thing. Um, and we're getting ready for, for work and all that kind of stuff. And then all of a sudden, Tucker wakes up and, and his like, eye is just... Oh my gosh. It was a little bit, little bit like red underneath before he went to bed. Yeah, like... And I was like, allergies? Because he's like runny nose and stuff. So I gave him just like a little bit of... The doctor's like, you try a little bit of Benadryl. Maybe it's allergies. And then when he woke up, I was like, this is not allergies. It's not. <laughs> and it, it's like, I mean, it, it really just threw us... It, it just throws for a loop. And yeah. so we're like, okay, he obviously can't, because, you know, he goes to work with Lacey, and, like, he can't go into nursery mm -hmm. um, at the school. And so we kind of made this decision where I was going to take him. Um, I think that we made that decision based on, A, Lacey's, she's almost done with school for the summer. She's really swamped. I was able to kind of move some meetings around. But also, Tucker usually does pretty good with me. Mm -hmm. And Landon does pretty good with Lacey. Yeah. As far as, like, doctor's visits and stuff. Yeah, we just know how to, like, how they work just as far as the level of being, you know, the fear in them. Yeah. He mm -hmm. just can work well with Tucker better, and I'm the same with Landon. We just yeah. relate better with that, with them that way. But also, like, I'm really glad we made that decision. Um, and it was kind of one of those things where we just had peace about it and we just mm -hmm. went on. It wasn't like a thing where we kind of thought about it too much. Yeah. But I'm really glad we made that decision because, well, obviously, you saw we had to go to two different doctors. And when we got to the eye doctor, um, I mean, it, guys, we were at the doctors for about four and a half hours. I'm um, going on five. And so that was a long time um, I mean, for both of us, but for Tucker. Um, I was at work all day like, what's going on? Kimmy posted, yeah. Kimmy posted, what's going on? Like, so yeah. that was hard. And so the shot knowing. where um, I videoed when like Tucker was kind of crying and everything, they had to get in his eye and kind of dilate it. And I thought that was going to be the worst. That wasn't the worst. The worst was when after about 20 minutes after it was dilated, the doctor had to come in and had to check in his eye because they were really concerned that if this whatever Infection. gets in his eye behind the eye and the retina and all that kind of stuff it can start causing um scar like it can start scarring and that's a whole Permanent damage yeah whole 
whole other problems and stuff. And so it was crazy how it just started as like, oh, it's probably just some kind of weird reaction to, oh my gosh, like we need to get to the eye doctor immediately. And so mm -hmm. it was just like, it's crazy how things just kind of escalate, you know, in life sometimes. And so that's where we're at. And But the thing that was so hard and why I really think it was so good for me to be there, not Lacey, is because Tucker wouldn't open his eye. He was done. He was exhausted. He didn't want to do it. So the doctor's like, we're going to have to force him to open his eye. Mm -hmm. I'm like, great. So the doctor's like, hey, Justin, I need you to bear hug him. So I'm on the, 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 the black chair. Tucker's on my lap. I'm bear hugging him like this, trying to hold his arms down. And then another male nurse was grabbing his feet and then like his legs because he was kicking his legs. And then another male nurse was grabbing his head. And then the doctor was, you know, prying his eye. So basically there was like, there was four, four of us like holding down Tucker. And I'm like, I'm like, I don't even know where the, his strength is coming from. Like, and not to mention like what was really hard is like Tucker doesn't cry. Like he cries, but not like super loud. Like his, it's not that loud, but yeah. he was, I've never seen him. I've never seen him cry this hard before. And uh, it, it was definitely really hard for me. It was kind of, it was traumatizing for me. Mm -hmm. uh, I just couldn't imagine Lacey being in there, but I'm literally holding him like this and all the doctors around and, and the doctor's just going in with his eye, like, you know, just pretty rough because he's mm -hmm. moving around, you know? And so the skin was breaking and started bleeding a little bit because he had to get in. And it just, I looked down at one point, I'm like, oh my gosh, it was pretty, it was pretty intense. It looked really bad when I got home. Yeah. Like Justin's like, his eye looks pretty angry. And when yeah. I saw it, I was like, cause before it was like red and swollen. And then after it was like, you know, cause it bled and stuff. Mm -hmm. So he, he told me about it and I was like crying, just him telling me about it. So he's like, yeah, I'm really glad you weren't actually yeah. there. <laughs> so it was good. It was a good call. Yeah. Um, anyway, so he, the doctor finally was able to like look and he's like, okay, this is good news. There's nothing in the eye. Yeah. Um, and that's great. So he prescribed mm -hmm. us uh, two different kind of medicines. Um, and one of the medicines is an eye drop. And he's like, let's not use that eye drop unless you start seeing his eye being red. If his right. eye is being red, you got to start that. But that eye drop stings really, really bad. Yeah. And so, like, I hope we never have to. Because basically, if it starts getting red, that's when we're like, there could be, like, scarring happening mm -hmm. and all that kind of stuff. So we're really still hoping that doesn't happen. And we're obviously not out of the woods yet with this. Um, but basically what it is, yeah. <laughs> is, um, it's the best way to explain it is that it's, it's a virus in his eye and it's like a cold sore basically. Mm -hmm. So like, you know, you get a cold sore, like on your, like a canker sore on your lip or something after you're sick, um, or anything like that. That's yeah. what it is. And he's been sick. He had a fever for a while, mm -hmm. like a couple days. Um, so he just kind of got over it and they say sometimes it'll flare up after yeah. you get over like a sickness. So, um, Justin gets cold sores usually like you, you usually when, you get when sick I'm stressed or, stressed or sunburned or um, sick. Yeah. And that's funny because the doctor said, look, this is the thing. This, because, because we had pictures of this happening a year and a half ago, and it happened two times yeah. in a matter of six months apart or so. And we'll actually pop that photo up here. Mm -hmm. And so we had an idea that we're like, this is probably what it is because it was in yeah. the same eye. Um, same kind of look, mm -hmm. except this looked just a lot more angry than the last one. And yeah. the doctor's like, yep, this is exactly what happened a year and a half ago. Yeah. And this is the thing. This will be with him the rest of his life. Yeah. Um, it's always going to come back in this eye, either when he gets sunburned, he's stressed, he's sick. sick. Same kind of stuff with cold sore. And he said, now when he gets older, your body might learn to fight it. Mm -hmm. So it won't get to this. However, it's still going to be the virus will still be there basically. Mm -hmm. So we're yeah. really hoping that his body will learn to fight this. Um, but as of right now, um, we have some pretty heavy dose of prescription to mm -hmm. hopefully clear it up. We were hoping that this morning it would look a lot better. Um, and it didn't, mm -mm. um, he can't even open his eye this morning. Yeah. Um, yesterday he could open his eye. I think it could be due to also like how bruised up it was from having to open his eye and stuff mm -hmm. yesterday. So, Hoping today being like a full dose of that stuff and yesterday, hopefully tomorrow it will be better. Yeah. But that's, that's what we, that's what we know. Right. So c thank you again for your prayers and just continue to pray because we just don't want this to get into his eye mm -hmm. is the main thing. Yeah. Cause that's when it could be really serious. But like he's, he's playing, he's, and he's, playing running he's running around, he's yeah. laughing and he's doing his thing. So that kind of helps. I think mm -hmm. if he was like not doing those things, it would be harder for us to process that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But again, that's pretty much all we know right now. We'll 
continue to keep you guys updated and um, all that on Instagram and, and Facebook and maybe on, on YouTube as well as the days progress. But we just want to say again, thank you for just the support from mm -hmm. you guys. It was very overwhelming and uh, meant a lot to us. We weren't going to throw a picture on Instagram and we weren't going to vlog it, but we're like, no, we're going to do this. Yeah, because like, I think you guys need to see like the not so good parts. And we've shared that too mm -hmm. on our channel. Um, if you've seen before what's happened to our other son yeah. on Disney Cruise Line. A lot of you guys yeah. know, if not, we'll link that down below. But, you know, just things that, you know, in life that happen, especially with kids, mm -hmm. is so scary. And as parents, I think you just feel like the worst parent because our job is to just protect them. And when you don't or things happen to them and it's out of your control, it just, it's a really sucky feeling. And so any of you parents know that feeling, you know, yeah. just to relate with that because you f always feel like, oh, it's our fault, you know, mm -hmm. but it's not and it happens and it's mm -hmm. life, you know. Yeah. And so um, I think it's good just to let other people know that you're not alone in it. Yep. You're not a bad parent and just, you know, we're trying our best and um, things are going to happen and we can't control that. Yeah. But so that's why we decided to show it. Yeah. And you know, we had something completely different planned for this video for yeah. this today, but it's life changes and we want to show that. And, mm -hmm. and, and those of you who are vloggers, it is hard to pull out a camera when you're in the middle of like a crisis situation. Yeah. But on the other hand, it really helped me process through the day. That's what I was thinking too, yeah. especially with you with this kind of stuff. It's like, it's like I was crying just hearing about it. But for him, like he's very like, I mean, you're just, you're really compassionate. And so he just like, he's like, I ha it's really hard for Justin just to see our kids go through anything. But when he was like talking it through, I think like it was helping you mm -hmm. go through it with him too and yeah. just processing it better. Yeah, So it did. Yeah. And I felt like you guys were there with us in the doctor's office as well. So it, you know, it was, it felt it was all alone. <laughs> yeah, it felt, it felt awesome. So, yeah. but anyways, guys, again, thank you so much for hanging out with this video and uh, all the compassion you guys showed um, during this, this weekend. We appreciate you guys and love you guys so much. And uh, we'll see you guys on the next one. Bye. Bye.